is one of the starting points of Crow Creek. And on the other side of me right here is a big wall. I'm going to go on the other side and record that too. And it's blocking off. You can't even see the creek while you're driving. You wouldn't know this is behind the wall. And hopefully I'm in the frame. And then to the left of me are like these new townhome buildings. So it looks like they're trying to block some type of energy with this sectioned off thing with the creek behind. And I'm going to go ahead and try to zoom up on the creek. Do you see that? Do you see that? I'm not making this up, bruh. Bruh, I'm not making it up. What? get to the creek i'm up here like in the hills and there's all these farms with horses and lambs and sheep and i'm gonna try to get a video with these cows and hopefully i find somewhere close where i can get a video with the horses too there's a cow is she looking at me hey girl Hi, Divine. How are you? Okay. I'm putting my palms up and I'm walking to them. At least that works for dogs, sometimes cats. They're just staring at me. Uh oh. What's that about? Now I just need to find the creek. <laughs> oh snap. This is so crazy. Hey, yeah, I'm here. Two benches, no bus stop. I don't know what the benches are for. So that's the stuff I be talking about. Like that's that's the portal signature right there. I just got the eye to see it. All right. And then you got the sun shining between the two. Let's see if there's any engravings. Nope. So you got the creek right here. And usually when I find something, it's always by water. And then there's a tree behind one bench. And then there's a tree behind me on the bench that I'm on. I feel like I should sit in the middle to do a channeling. But it's like in the middle of an office park, so that might look heck of crazy. Oh my God, and look at the sign. Look at the sign. Look at the sign behind me. What does it say? What does it say? Center points. It says center point. Right there. Center point. And look at this wild building too. Looking like an upside down pyramid. All right, I had to do it like this because the Overturn our power to expel the energy vortexes that may be open. 
opening are still even closed, that are here to suck in our life force. I am uprooting our warriors. I am uprooting the nature spirits. I am uprooting our sacred mother and father trees of time. I am uprooting our Akashic records to remember who we are, to spread the power of portals, all right? Alright, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right. So yeah, that, that was Crow Creek because you have this right here. Crow Canyon Office Park. And then you have Center Point. Alright, let's get to the creek. Alright, it looks like somebody else found this place too. Look at it. And this was like the um the beginning of that movie, Blair Witchcraft, wherever that movie is, where they go to the forest and they find the witch and they never and they do in the videotape documentary. Usually a scene like this you're supposed to leave, but I was really guided here. So no fear. Only joy. Wow. I'm not gonna touch that stuff though. Woo! It's cold! They got you thinking that you only want to sweep. But there is water and blood. Where you see water, you see blood. Blood that has been shed by choice. Blood that has been shed by force. Blood that has been shed by sacrifice. Blood that has been shed by offering. Blood with tears, blood with smiles. And with this blood, it nourishes your bone. It nourishes the vines of Mother Earth. It nourishes the pathways of the cosmos. It nourishes the sun rays. It nourishes the tree branches. It nourishes the bone marrow. It nourishes. And with the vibratory nourishment is where the message comes. And with the vibratory nourishment is where the message leaves. There is a high elevation that starts with blue, then goes to red, then goes to orange, then goes to yellow, and at the top is the white light. And as it starts this way, it starts the other. It starts with white, it goes to yellow, it goes to orange, it goes to red, and it ends with blue. And in the blue, you see the glistening hue. You see the crystal light codes. And I literally see them right now, oh my God. Woo. Oh, whoa, what the? It almost looks like those digital version, those cyberpunk like waves, like I can't explain it, like it's like silver circular orbs that form into green. And this is where that glisten was when I saw the sun and then it was shining down. I'm guessing it was right here and right there. Look at that glisten. That's what it looked like in my eyes, that right there. Look at that. No filter. Here's another example of an archway. Sun's right there. Archway, water, and almost like a fort right there. You see that? So first I found this big one, and then I found the smaller one in the creek. I'm using another tree branch as a tripod. Shout out to the to the trees aiding me through in this journey. So I found, ooh, yo, I found this one and I was like, I don't want to take it. So then I went to the water and I got this one. And this is a sacred, sacred sign. I don't know what to call it. Coven, secret lineage, sacred, whatever, secret society. Ah! 
Okay, obviously I wasn't supposed to say that. What the? But, so I'm gonna take this one with me. Oh my God. Wow, this is powerful. Also, whoever, in all seriousness, whoever lives here might be homeless. So I'm just gonna leave them a couple dollars because I feel like I was all up in their home. And this space is sacred, obviously, and they're dedicated to this space. Even if it's just somebody that hangs out here, I'm still leaving them a couple dollars. Look at it. Look at it. No. Yeah.